Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to the Hearts of Iron for Old World Blues A to Z series, in which we're playing as everyone's favorite numbered nation, at least for now. The 215th, as you can see, we're a little bit at a war right now with some good old Reavers of the Sky. They've already lost 2200. We've been doing pretty darn well, and they lost so much because, well, I love encirclements. And I try to make them as much as I can, but basically, I was just waiting until we get to this point so we can do some more of this. Um, it's mostly leading infantry. Actually, it's all infantry. Let's do a little bit of that. Uh, our unit leader, Sterling Bowie, Bowie, doing quite well. Uh, honestly, at this point, it was level 5. It doesn't really need inspiration. I, I like that one a lot, though. Uh, you know what? I actually want to go local leader. I usually don't choose that one. And just in case for defense, let's get a little rooted. Cool. But we've got some comms to go through. we got some valuable hollow tapes. We haven't done all of this stuff up here, because I read through all of these in the last video, but a star is born. In the chain gang days, the war would occasionally reward us with showing us, showings of movies before the war. What if we could, could make our own with all these cameras? So at this point, we're just going to say hello, goodbye, and die. For amusement. Oh, the Arch King is now dead. Ah, beautiful. I love it. Let's see, we get 1.4 political power, single, which is actually pretty darn decent. Star is born. Uh, tributize, sure, we could try, but I assume they would reject. I would reject it too, personally, but whatever. Scavenging the vehicles currently, war measures, mobilize people, focus on internal sphere. Eh, close out of that one. And this one, and uh, call for a raid. Ruthless drill, seize raider arms. I don't like any of these, so no thanks. We'll be alright without those. And anything over here? So, so, so slaver dude. Yeah. Um, less organization. This one's. It's not. I don't want her organization. But this is not bad. Better supply consumption. I like that a lot. But don't really need it too much. Non core manpower might be okay as well. We got over 10,000 manpower, so I'm not re. We're not really hurting for that at all. Um, infrastructure wise, we're okay. Ship stuff, we're okay. Um, motorized vehicles. Tank. Heart attack. It's only 5% more heart attack and research speed. Vehicle technology. 15% more research speed. It's not bad. Better liability in armor versus max speed. I think if we go with max speed, we'll go with that one. And God Slayer War in the Max in Chapter, they. Oh. Way to try to hurt someone when they're down. Jesus Christ. <laughs> cool. But we got them sky, good old Sky Reavers. Very, very nice. So I think, and I believe, we are just applying on the good old Yakuza next. If I remember correctly, we will get some uh, these guys too. Yeah, we got about halfway there towards taking out the Yakuza. And what else we got here? Armor would be nice. Be great because we have special forces divisions, spec ops divisions. Actually, go and start eh, this first. Let's see. We got these guys over here. At least 75. That's 75. Just go and just use some army XP to do this, anyways. We released 20 combat with some anti tanks, fire teams, some demos, and recons. Oh, we were so close. There we go. Just make them perfectly. Can't afford many, but that's all right. Investigate rumors, you might as well. 180 days is going to be quite a while, but that's okay. Garrison would always well. I guess we can do strange communications or Crapberg Vipers. Effing power armor. What do we get? Effing power armor? Basic power armor tech. It's not much, though. Oh. Oh, we got goals here. Big bad word bombs. Well, let's do the crapper, crap bag vipers. When we were smaller at one point, we tried settling in viper territory. They ended up kick us out. The nerve of some people, you know. I love it. Uh, twenty out of twenty-six. I was thinking twenty. I forgot it was, wasn't uh, twenty out of twenty. It's I thought it was twenty-four out of twenty-four. So well, stars born. If you're about secret sauce too, please go to have. But a fun memory among the two hundred fifteenth is how the Jericho Warden would take them out on an old drive-in after the work shifts. Over boss Marianne. To kind of, or to kindle respect amongst her gangs, want to reshoot some of these old pre war movies I used to watch, giving them the leading roles to members of the gang. The Barfly. Wow, more passive caps and clubs. It's very expensive. The Communist from Space. Night of the Fish Men's Revenge. The Fighting Fury's Last Stand at Fort McGee. Love Set Sail. Oh, and they suck this one. She gets daily compliance. World Now Starlet. Ripper. I like. Ripper, I hardly know her. Anyways, lots of people who are interested in movies have seen the flick. Some say it's Vera Key's best role. We're going to have to look over time, or work over time, to get a faithful reproduction of this movie out of the door. A custom set, custom lighting, reaching out to California for actors, maybe even a producer. Eat your heart out, our Vera. Marianne's one of the big shots now. Awesome. We're going to Warfare. I mean, I wanted to go with uh, Asymmetric, like I said in the last video, but it is what it is. 
And I realized one last time too, which is very nice. Alright, so now we can just stack more bodies over here and go and train for now as well. Um, that's not bad, 50-50. Very nice, very, very nice actually. What are we building up currently? We're building up a civvy, which is nice, not bad. We're going to need some plating as well. And come over here and yes. Get to drive. Awesome. I think power armor. We also draw it. I don't think I read these two last time. I read this one though. Let's go do this one next. Let's go to political power. Strange communications. We'll also do a carousel droids. The director of TV Town used to control a swarm of Mr. Gutsy. It's tasked with defending carousel. With a better work, we can test these robots to a new role. Call your robots. It's nice to have a couple robots that can cook for you. The previous stars of carousel have plenty of these cook bots on hand at all times. They can help you make your meals and they would be delivered to your house or wherever you were staying. That's a very convenient device, but I am a human chef. One of the robots protested, silly, silly machines. You're about as human as I am. Wait, but... Alright, so now we go to war with these guys. Very nice. They look super strong. Uh, up to 14 divisions. The best you can. One, no wonder you're losing. Can I actually do well here? Well, let's see. Doing a little bit of damage, not bad. It's an okay amount. Not a superior amount, but an okay amount for now. We even one division attacking these guys, and not doing too bad, so. Not bad, not bad. Prospect. So much money do we actually have? That's not bad. 13 every month is okay. So we have this one. We're going to route to New Canaan. Nice. Strange communications, metal cash. We're going to do this again. Please go ahead. But there you go. Look at all that PP we got. Standardized tools. Metal working. And supply consumption. I don't know which is really going to help. That's, uh, that's not going to help do anything for us. Rate of conscripts? Uh, we could. Kind of like autarky. Light ships. Over here. Greasers. Let's go with put a lot of infrastructure. Let's do that one. Hente del Sol. Going, guys, you're doing great. Uh, quite a bit ahead of time, but whatever. I just go this way, too. Goodbye. We lost 22 or 3, that's not bad. After these guys, is there anything for Reno? Arms. That's it. Well, that's the case. I think we probably should uh, do a little bit of this too. Oh, 15 days. That's pretty nice. Oh, they're forcing attack. Or forcing defense, actually. Metal cash. Nice. Android scavenger, you're this game. Please go ahead, too. Very nice. Delightful. Look at that army XP. Not enough. Never enough, but still. There you go. Thank you, Yakuza Territories. Thank you very much. It's going to see how... Actually, could go to the Vipers? Hopefully. Um, <clears> the <throat> world blues has changed over the years. I remember the Yakuza being like this destruction. And stuff like that, but yeah. Interesting. We'll go to war with them too. Get rumors. Nah. Armor hardening. Yeah. Um. Or raiders. Grenades. I'm gonna burn stuff. I'm in a very burny mood for this campaign, so let's do that. Oh my god, you guys take so long. Just go. There you go. Nice. Uh, here we can play one Arroyo. Well, let's see what happens now. Now can we do any of this? 
But there's superiority, we should be able to. I'm not sure the plans are doing, but should be able to do it up here. Enjoy scavenging, color it bots. A little bit of a grind doesn't hurt us too much. We have plenty enough manpower. We'll get more as time goes on. We'll get way more army XP. Gabs. Pretty good. Beautiful. So over here. Nope. Keep building, building, building. Hold and go and get the front lines, get all the planning done, and then attack. Three, two. One, let's abuse them as best we can. And any damage? Yes. Good amounts of damages. Oh, we have the special forces already done. Nice. Hope we get someone worthwhile here. Joshua Barnes. Now you can be inspirational. Built to destroy. Less defense, more attack. I'm okay with that. Side energy schematic. That's cool. Hey, and there go the vippers. Ah, culinary bots. And we have a cup of green tier too to keep us nice and warm. Nice. Ah, portable radios, nice. Very good, very good. We need a crap ton of these things. They're gonna attack us? No. No, I thought that they would. Ah, now they're coming. You hang out. Don't worry about attacking for now. Recon? Yes. Ah, we're right up here. Well, if we really want to, we can just do it like this. We'll front line. Oh, there were these guys too, the den. Why is it taking so long to kill the den off? It's fine with me, whatever. Get us a droid. Let's do bad female dog uh, bombs. Oh, well, let's time these so that when we throw them, they take for just a few seconds, bringing a little fear into the hearts of the crap bags we're flying right before we blow their faces off. So, one of the first comments was, oh heck yeah, a series. Yeah, it's going to be a long series, the whole A to Z series for Old World Blues. Oh boy. Someone says, hurrah, he considered the idea. Thank you so much. Now I have a very exciting series to watch with dinner. Hey, well, hope you enjoy dinner if you watch this while you're eating. So, uh, we're going to we're gonna have to really work on this thing here. Um, we'll head to town, grab, you know, let's head to town, whatever we're doing anyways. At the end of the series, someone says, if it'll go until then, you should put some ISP music as a way of tribute. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a good idea, yeah, maybe. Or, well, I have a sure I have also something else in mind as well. So, so it says, A to Z, yeah? I like it. And someone says, I saw Productions would be proud, and I hope he would be. I don't think he knows I exist. Alex the Rambler, Alex the Rambler has commented on one of my videos before. I actually made a series on him. Because there's an Alex the Rambler mod, but, you know. So, having power armor. God, I love this stuff. Put this on, boys. Ah, uh, cool bikes. Mariano is one that uh, always used to ride liking up ramps and making big jumps back in Utah. Vipers Town. We beat up the Vipers, took the guns, brought them low, had fun with the women, but we just can't kill them, I guess. Breeders have to stick up for each other, you know? Let's set up a little town for them that they can live from. Crazy Joe, or Crazy F Face Jackals. Cannibals, how disgusting. I'm revolting just thinking about living with these guys. I can't risk my men living near them, let's bring them to heal. Jackal Town. If these freaky jackals might be F, but they can still be useful to us if we leave a few of them around. Let's make a little town for them to live in. Mostly so that uh, <clears throat> we can keep them away from our camps. Cash. I love money. And as you can see on screen, we've done a little bit of damage so far to New Reno. Casualty is about a thousand ish versus sixty two hundred. It has actually been putting in some work. I might I mean we've only done fifty five percent, but like we're the ones majorly who've been trying to push hard as we can into New Reno territory. Even though they're 
taking forever to capitulate, which sucks. So I'm giving the guys a little bit more time to get things done. I might give them, these guys something over here. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe not. I might just take it all for ourselves. Yeah, I'll probably do that in the end. That's not like the most fun. You know, taking everything for ourselves. Why not? Uh, right now, we can't do any focuses, which does suck quite a bit. And we're still waiting to do a Love Sets Sale. But we're getting about 40 caps a month. That ain't bad. Of course, we're just going to get new Reno 2, which would be very, very nice. So once we take new Reno, I guess that's not the capital. I guess the Sierra Army Depot is the capital right now, but you know it is what it is. Actually, we need to re-justify on these guys because we justified, but then it's been taking so long. That was re-justify, which sucks, but whatever. Can you guys actually just do this at this point? You might be able to. Yeah, I mean, we should have air superiority at this point. Another pre-war pre forbidden base. 34 to roughly 45 damage. Nice. Yeah, the AI likes to do a lot of force defense. So in return, I just do a lot of force attack. So, yeah. Which helps cut down on their divisions by quite a bit, so. Got them out there, too. Two divisions there ain't bad, but... <clears throat> Once these guys are gone, we'll attack here. Come on, good. Sierra Army Depot would be nice. Go there, too. Get up there as well, don't lose it. Please, love a guy, don't lose it. And got some rapid uh, processing. Prototyping? Prototyping, yeah. That's great to you that we have here. It's pretty good, too. Now, if you'd like to help out, you guys can do this, too. Ah, we finally got him. You know what? Screw it. I'll take everything. Thank you very much. Get some of that, too. All right. So now, we can do this one, which I read earlier off screen. Um, before we go to war, the Protectron Security Hub, we'll just do this first as well. Uh, New Reno down here. There's the outskirts, but New Reno itself. We have to wait for this to get done. Uh, begin a route from here to about San Francisco. Yeah. Get a route. That'd be great because we're also going to. Well, 60,000 people live here. It's a lot. Build that up and build that up because we want to build it up so we get more money. Because money is useful. Usually. Usually. Go to the two, go do that, do this, do that, and then do this, and then boom, 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 and Alice Watson. What? Wallace. Awesome Wallace. Cool. Radar, yes. Uh, for now, I, I already know we're going to get a World War of the 80s. It's going to suck. But it's alright. We'll get there. And also, we've expanded uh, all the way up to here for. Infantry perks, which is very good. And crazy F face jackals. Cash! I love money. And all of them. And then uh, top readers of Nevada. Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? Feels effing good to be on top. Yeah, buddy, yeah, do. Do they attack us at all? Do they have enough divisions for their entire land border? Oh, yeah, it looks like they barely do, but yeah. But some spots are going to look very weak. I love, I love how much political power we have. We're still the Sierra Army Depot? Oh, you betcha. Excavate the lab? Sure. Open the hangars. Oh. Listen to the remains of a bygone age. Perhaps we can find something amongst its ashes. Seems that like there's something underground. Something buried on purpose under tons of rock. But why? There's only one way for us to find out. We'll have to dig into the depths of the Earth itself. And open the hangars. Plunder to the military base for what it's worth. A uh, virtual treasure trove of pre-war aircraft awaits us. We just need enough time and effort to let them soar through the air once more. It's gonna hurt our consumer goods by quite a bit, but oh, whatever. Oh, we've got a really good encirclement here. Nice. Six divisions. Jesus, that's a lot of divisions there. Oh, they're all dead. I love it when you massacre enemies. I don't love getting cash, too. We also get dig get Poseidon energy, but I want to wait to get do that one maybe. So, wow, let's take a while for the Max and Chapter to be defeated. Not bad on these guys. <clears throat> nice. Doping waste, rapid re redeployment. Nice, and we need get some of this as well. And the jackals are dead, as they should be. Jackal Town. I'll get the cores on here too. After that, because we're gonna go to war with these guys immediately. Let's repeat itself. Cool. That's way too out of time. 
Get some doggos. If someone should remind me in the comments, always, but always use doggos in your divisions while eating way more. That's a props. I love drugs. Don't quote me on that one. Um, how much money do we have now? Still, 88 a month is not bad. That's pretty decent, not gonna lie. Wait, why does Vault City own this? Do we have anything about Vault City here at all? Um, I guess not. Well, I guess we'll just fight against them too. I guess they're allied with the Cyclops searchers. Oh, that's a puppet. That's why. We found something? More research speed? Eh, you know, it's better than nothing. We're a bunch of intellectuals. Can we pierce them? Oh, you bet we can. No one can stop us now. Got plenty of fighters. Something from the front. Ah, you know what? That gets us 100%. It's only 3%, 2%, but you know what? Having 100% is pretty nice sometimes. So with that in mind, I'm not worried about that towel. So we'll come up here, and then we'll do all this and beat the crap out of them. They'll buy what? First Citizen Lynette? Yes, they are. Very nice. <clears throat> How much money do we have now? Not enough, of course. Jackal Town's very good, and the top Raiders are in a batter. Let's see. The straw that broke the Reno's back. I can't believe we actually managed to take the city. Let's loot it for all it's worth. Raiders of the Lost Vault. Off those snotty little pacifists, you have guns, use them. God darn idiots. Heading to Jericho. Marion thought herself she sat upon the riches of Elsmerado, Nevada. I'm rich enough now that I could, if I really wanted, take back Jericho from the crap heel F faces who wronged me back then. For Marianne, it wouldn't take much to convince her subordinates, Raiders, to fight for her. She already gotten them this rich after all. Beep. Beep boop. You die now. I'll pour Nuka Cola onto your mainframes, you douchebag uh, female dogs. Oh! Already killed them anyways. Grabbing your coffins. F you grabbers. Ripping up your hearts. Wouldn't it be funny if we just pretend to be traitors for, for a few days and just start shooting for no reason? And creepy mean dudes. They touch the sky. Imagine digging out a pre-war forbidden bunker full of ancient plants. Not quite what we hoped Area 51 would have, but it's better than nothing. We can say it's designed for all purposes. Nice. I guess not every bunker can have power armor. Target practice for the boys. We're doing it for the boys, everybody. Ah, yes. More drug trade profits. I love it. But it's time to go beat up some... Women? No, Lynette. No. Um, and they're uh, apparently war with uh, the Thunderbirds, which is kind of interesting itself. Um, they're war with a bunch of guys now. I actually not don't know anything about the Thunderbirds. They're like the 80s, but not. Basically the 80s, but not. But we will have to fight the 80s. Just being realistic here. Definitely, definitely, definitely have to fight the 80s. Defense is online? Great! Oh, scan for more stuff. Um, what's going on down here? Anything else? Oh, look at this. Yes. Love set sail. Ah. Yes. Oh, Jesus Christ. 1600 days. Oh, that's nice. As we're excavating the lab. Jericho's Raider Queen. Caps from coring per infrastructure. Plus 15. World renowned Starlet. Ah. I know we were destined for fame. You can limit when they want to go to war. Ah, oh, so we just go to war them anyways. Uh, it's only 25 days, that's not bad. Um, what else we got here? Rooted. We're good for infantry. Inspirational. Let's go Mysterious Stranger. Yeah. That'll be good. Advanced tools. Nice. Keep working on the civvies too. Mm, Reno's fine. That place down there is fine. Go straight to that one too, it's fine, whatever. That too? Very nice. See, they are loves force defense. Loves it. Now we can breach facility too next. Nice. That'd be good. Losses? Oh, not. Uh, 113 versus 543. They, these guys are sucking hard. It's fine with me, I'm not really too concerned. Hey! Would you look at that? Another encirclement! Also, we can't do any focus right now because we can't be in any sort of offensive war of any offensive war justifications either. So, it is what it is. Um, for us, I think it'd be, make more sense if we had scrap motorcycles, I think. For our Raider-esque nation. 
Eh, sure. I keep doing this once because it gives you plus two percent more army XP game, so we'll see. Nice fall fall team. They can't stand much more. No, they cannot. Yeah, these guys are really disappointing. These guys are not very good. Like I said, it's fine with me though. I was going to put us in a terrible position with the 80s. We need a massive line to hold here. And then we need a line to put hold here. And a line to hold here. That's why I want to get at least 10 more divisions going at, at all times. So Keep going. If we can take Gecko, we got him. I'm not going to share the bountiful booty with anyone else. Old World Computer. Uh, how many more days until we have to go to war with them? July 4th, Raiders of the Lost Vault. Oh, yeah. We can do that one, but yeah, might as well. Might as well. Cool. Alright, everybody, let's get on the line. Get a little bit of radar here. Get some radar over here, too. And go up to 30 because you can. Any other planes we can throw in? Uh, a little bit. Not much. yourselves like this probably isn't a good idea, but whatever. We're going to go in anyways, even though that's completely open right there, but whatever. If we lose Bayou Wave, or they lose Bayou Wave, that's not good. At the same time, these guys don't look very strong at all. What's wrong with them? 45,000 manpower. They must be out of equipment or something here. 27. No fighters. No, they, got, they got some equipment. They definitely have some equipment, so... Not entirely sure what's up with them. Hello. Give these guys a place. You know, they're losing to us. Christopher Barnum. Huh. Yes, we can't do any of these until we're not in an offensive war, so it is what it is, but whatever. Let's see what we can do. We're trying to do as much damage as we possibly can right now, and overall it's going quite well, I'd say. Still doing a good amount of damage. Ooh, I can open some nice. I guess what city was uh, uh, a city. That street was okay with me. To New Canaan. Yeah, that's actually okay with me. West Texas Manics, nice. Power, uh, but we don't get power armor. Nice, pretty good. Good red mutts. Get this as well. We're gonna come over here and do that too. Yay! I don't think we had a hundred for that, but whatever. Well, we're doing, I'd say, quite well, especially if we're using mostly infantry. Overall, not bad. Not bad. Really, quite good. How many divisions we got? Up to 92. That's a lot of divisions. We have like 36, and our divisions aren't super, super great, but you know, doing all sorts of damage up here. Um, here, start building some of this up to the Cabal. You know what, let me know in the comments below. What should we use for intelligence agency name for this campaign? Even though there's probably only one more episode left after this one. Let me know what you think in the comments below. We just get a, look at all that. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, plus 2%. So that's plus 28% army XP gain. That's very nice. There you go, get those special forces in there, they'll do great. Can't do anything here. We'll get a little crap ton of political power. Also, we did get a military academy training already. I guess we could get core stuff if we really wanted to, but as we're going on, let's see. Do we get any more cores besides like what we've already done? So, we foothold. Uh, Jericho becomes a core. City 318. 318. White likes core territories. 80s core territories. Bayo Wave. Frisco City. Lincoln. Gold Hill. Well, a lot of the territories we don't actually get to core, so coming down here and coring stuff might be alright. 157. Oh, that's going to be really good at core 2. It's very quickly just very easy to spend this much political power. 8,000 versus 42,000. Pretty good population zone. We have more than enough stuff to use it now. There you go, do that. 
Level 5, very nice, very nice. Salvage motorcycles are a okay. I don't mind using some tanks maybe in this campaign as well. That sounds like fun too. Oh, we have bikes here already. Scrap motorcycles or bicycles? Motorcycles. You know what? You can hold. Let's get here first, and then we'll hold. Go and hold first. Let's get some more max planning for next. It's until September 5th, which is more than enough time for us. Ooh. Comments from space. Me and I would have tried watching this with the boys on more than one occasion, but none of them seem able to understand one of the critical plots points of the movie. The F is a communist. The movie would tell or sell a lot better if we change out the plot so Maybe instead of whoever the F of communist is, we can replace the enemies of the picture with legionnaires. And we can have brave raiders be the ones to F them over and establish themselves as the top dogs. Not a bad idea. We're making a lot of money now. Get more planning done, get the planes ready to go, and start gunning down our enemies like the dogs that they really truly are. Three. Two. Oh, wow, well, we need actually more demo equipment and anti tank. So three, three. Three. That'd be good. We need way more infantry armor, too. Ah, uh, they're attacking us as well. You know what? Let's not even try attacking them while they're trying to attack us. They want to kill themselves on our line. That's fine with me. They're really cheap. I love how cheap they are. Oh, cost. Doctrine cost. Oh, co cost reduction bonus. Minus 50%. No wonder it's so cheap. These guys just found nothing good out of our office. Love it. I love how much they're attacking right, us right now. Nice. Right, way more divisions. They might attack us a little bit. Oh, yep, I knew they attack us a little bit more. 10,000. How much more member do you have? You know what? We got. We can make enough political power here. We're just going to just them just in case. It's not much. We get over. T we get two and a half a day without doing a focus, which is just so nice. More time. 2.3. 4.2. No planes, because we need more military factories. But whatever. Allison Howard, awesome. Go over here and start doing forming departments. Figure out exactly everything that they really do have. So we can strip it down, strip them down, and then never mind. Um, support commit, special forces. They don't have very much left of infantry commit. Nice. Three, two, a one. Let's uh, go. Come on, I think they're going to attack us one more time at least. Come on, no? Alright then, whatever. Let's go in. Just have a good old time with them. Use them and abuse them. Beautiful. Tracks and provides tanks, yes please. More divisions, oh, you know what, taking all this time is okay, just because we're gonna need more time later on anyways. Uh, I'll go to that anyways, more because we also have to fight the 80s, and this is really good practice for the 80s. Very, very good practice for the 80s, actually. How much more do we really need? 12,000 losses, Jesus. They gotta be out of, yeah, they gotta be out of manpower at this point. Nice, we won. Good. We can pierce himself, right? Should be able to. Especially for their motorized. Come on. Oh, the Fitty Knights are gone. That sounds really cool. Infinity Knights. You got stuff down here, too. It's slow going. That's why I put anti tank on everything you got. We win eventually. Yes, we can. There we go. I hate the 80s. Well, the actual decade of the 80s. No. Must have been a fun time. Yeah, a lot of drugs, but whatever. There you go. Even more army XP gain. Max it out. Instead of focusing on special forces.
cool. Mm, anything we really care about there? Uh, we could really raid him if we really wanted to, but... Oh! Oh, quite a bit of lag. Oh, Kazar must be... Flip. There goes Kazar. Oh, it does... It would help if we actually have planning, too. I guess we technically do. Get more planning, please. 21%, 24%. They're looking really bad in some spots. And I'm so, I apologize for taking so long with this, but you know, I'd rather we get it done right the first time. Anything else? Three, two, one. Go. More max planning, yes. You guys force it. You got a command power. I let everyone force it. No, oh, Northwestern Brotherhood, Sisters of Steel. Wait, what? Sisters of Steel? Oh, hello. Dan? Who the heck is Dan? Point Uber Dan, okay. The one Sisters of Steel, Sent until Honor. Oh, I need to play this faction. But we'll get them all with this series. I mean, I'm planning on playing pretty much every nation in the world blues again, so. My god, taking these guys out takes me such a pain in the butt. But we'll get him. We'll get there. We'll get in there. No assault. Salvage cars. They've got to be out of equipment. They've got to be out of everything, including manpower. Dev equipment, some fire teams, special forces, sport equipment. Thunderdome is ours, we got him. Oh, do we take all the territory too? Liberation of the 80s. Oh, well, okay, we got him. Oh, good God. We have so much a big border with them, it's not even funny. But ourselves, the Nessus Bank between the 80s made us seen as, green, uh, seen as a savior of the people among the wastes. The 80s were the scourge of Utah for countless years, even though they're still there. Now, thanks to our efforts, they're about a memory. Some felt that we were simply going to usurp the raid and power they held by abstaining and giving power back to the subjugated people we have instead shown a resolve and standing by the needs of the wasteland. They love us. Liberation of the 80s for a year. Weekly manpower, monthly population, division recovery rate, weekly stability, and factory output. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not bad. And the great race. Our race to remember. Followed up with, of course, ripping out your hearts out. Wouldn't it be just funny if we pretended to be traitors for a day and started shooting for no reason? So many caps, ah. We can't even hold all of them. This is crazy. Robbing Ruby Valley. A, bit of, a little bit of rating keep away keeps the ex existential dread away. Honorary power powder rank gangers. A few powder gangs have escaped from captivity in Nevada and have made their way to our lands. Marianne's boys are loving the stories they're hearing. Uh, great Khan refugees. Refugees from the Great Khans have made their way up north to our lands, telling us the stories of the NCR's vile raids on their lands and senseless strikes. Interesting. Vest Wisdom. One of the uh, members of the Ruby Valley uh, has actually been rather helpful in our post-conquest looting, offering assistance for raiders in exchange for a life and a place in our gang, City 318. City 318 is a strange model for a potential future city, a above-ground vault that was housed with the latest in state of the art infrastructure, at least by the time the bombs fell. 200 years later, the fabled City 318 isn't much different than any other dirt pile in the wasteland. Crescent Valley Treasures. Turns out that the Crescent Valley was a rather rich little, va rich little valley, a town that sustained itself through agriculture and crops. We can enslave the settlers here and eventually have them make food for us, and that, and maybe eventually they can teach us a thing or two. Cool hats. Check this one out. Isn't it fashionable? You, me, and, well, I guess the 80s are getting thrashed by the White Legs, even though, uh, they're part of Khazar's Legion, I guess. Um, they're getting destroyed by these guys, which means we'll probably have to fight the White Legs themselves. Which, oh, uh, don't look too strong in themselves, but I do want to go to war with these guys so we can get whatever we want from them. We might end up being at war with the Legion forever, but, you know, whatever. I'd rather take the territory if we possibly can. They have, like, no divisions. 21 here, that's just pathetic. But you know what? Whatever. We're going in. I don't care. And we'll probably go to war with these guys too. 30 days, that's not bad. Um, but yeah, we're going to do all these and then the C318. So that'd be good. Uh, Crescent Valley Treasures as well. Where's C318? Oh, it's over there. So we'll definitely have to make sure we take that one too. And let's see. So the C318, of course. There's that one. Select best for Jericho. Oh! Huh. 
claims and war goal for 80s core territories. These are a threat to, under, to underestimate. This isn't going to be a parade for fun or a war for profit. It's a proper slugfest, pure and simple. Cross uh, a Utah, Nevada, and Raider conscription has expanded further. The nature of a conflict are changing, moving from simple petty gang fights to moving to proper planned conflict. If we are expected to field so many troops across various raids, we need to begin our larger conscription effort. Restoring the happy trails, caravan route. Probably weird for raiders to go up and do something good, but the White Legs have been a major regional problem in eastern Utah for uh, quite a while. The Happy Trails Company has been complaining that the White Legs have been raiding Utah's caravans and played a role in the degradation of Jericho's settlement. That's why I have a mountain, profiting from the drug trade. Before, when we were a small gang, we participated in drugs mostly as consumers. Now that a bit larger, we can also probably take advantage of the drug trade not only as consumers, but also as suppliers. Why do drugs when you can make mo more money from not doing drugs? Drugs are expensive. That's why you only sell them. Anyways, you don't quote me on that one. Oh, they're going to go with Canaan in exile too? Not too shabby as well. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Go on in, guys. Have a good time. They're only the numbers. We'll probably start the next episode of War of These Guys, too. But, Tokyo Decadence? For some reason, we could only ever watch the first few minutes of this one. The tape seemed to always cut out by the time the pizza guy came into the hotel room with the barroom singer. We can fill in the plot. Maybe the name of the guy was Tokyo, and the story was a bit of a fall from grace from how his own sin and scars of his past kept him from advancing as a person. And only by becoming a raider and stealing pizzas from the che chef, down the street was able he was to become someone great and win the love of his life. Yeah. Yeah, Tokyo Decadence. That's the story. Don't ask me about the story of movies, because I don't watch very, movies very often. Well, Ruby Valley? That'd be nice. That'd be pretty nice to have. Oswald's told make trucks, make more military factories, all sorts of good stuff, too. We're making a lot of infrastructure as well. Hello. Yay! Wait, hang, hang dogs. Uh, we'll definitely take all this stuff here if we can. So, Valley. Oh, I'll also take this stuff, too. It's fine. Uh, if we can. Um, the White Legs do deserve to get some of this stuff too, anyway, so. There we go. Whatever, but I think we'll end the episode there. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we'll have a good time taking out the White Legs. God, I love White Legs. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.